Well, very soon, and uh, any day now, perhaps, the uh, Supreme Court is going to be ruling on President Biden's student loan forgiveness scheme. Um, and I just think that the American people find it offensive to think that they could take the 13 percent of people in this country who have student loans, take that debt, and transfer it to the 87 percent of people who don't have student loans. And that's what we're doing. This is all going on the, 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 the national debt. It's all on the federal debt. Uh, this was purely a political ploy on the President's part. And it's really unfortunate because um, I think that if you, if you look at uh, the people in this country who work hard every day, in many cases didn't have an opportunity to go to college, or those who have worked hard to help scrimp and save so they could uh, get through school, or their parents did that for them so they could get through school, um, or they paid their loans down. I mean, there are a whole lot of people in this country who fit into that category. It's the 87 percent of the taxpayers who are going to be footing the bill. The debt's going to be transferred to them from the 13 percent uh, who have student loan debt. And the really ironic thing about it is the National Bureau of um, uh, Economic Research found that this policy has encouraged people to take out even more student debt because they're getting some of their uh, debt paid down. They're, they're out taking out more uh, debt. So it's just leading to more debt on top of the debt that's already owed because they're not paying it back. Uh, the President clearly knew that the Supreme Court was likely to strike this down. I certainly hope that is what ends up happening. And I believe they went into this with their eyes open. But I also think it was, a, again, it was a political year, attempt to try and influence uh, votes in an election year. But really, truly unfortunate, because he hasn't done anything meaningful to address the high cost of college education. This was a, uh, a, a political ploy. And uh, ultimately, in the end, I think that I'm hoping, certainly, that the Supreme Court strikes it down. And when they do, there'll be a lot of unhappy people out there. And those unhappy people will have one place to look, and that's uh, the White House, because they went into this, I think, fully knowing that this was going to be struck down. I mean, a lot of people are going to have to start paying loans back. And, um, and that's what should have happened in the first place, the trillion-dollar giveaway uh, by this administration.